What's up, dude? Good, one. good, good crack. We got to start every episode with a crack. I, I don't have anything to crack, but I can <laughs> do like I can a. Sh- I can shake my Sonic. Shake a cup, Sonic. Yeah. World famous ice. Yeah, yeah. Good enough. It's the best ice. I've got a. I got to blame Will for a second. We were we had a crazy week, and I've been back on caffeine for a little bit. Oh, you got which off. I was off. Oh yeah, oh. way off. Okay, but I've been back on. But this is these yeah. little things. This ice yeah, caffeine yeah. drink. No sugar, no nothing. It's basically just flavored water with caffeine in it. All right. Pretty good. Yeah? Yeah. All right. How so long were you off caffeine? Oh, shit. Quite a while. Yeah? Uh, long enough where a Dr. Pepper would fucking get me just fucking <laughs> you. <laughs> Going for uh-huh. days. <laughs> I got off of that. I got off of, uh, of caffeine. I think it was for like, God, seven or eight months. I was off of it for years at one point. Were you? Yeah. That's a lot. I quit smoking and caffeine. No nicotine and no caffeine. Yep. I've oh. done it twice in my life, and I'm on my second time, but I, I kind of had to bring the caffeine back. I'm working two jobs now, dude. I didn't think it'd be this tough. Oh, yeah. You need that. You need that boost. The boost. Yeah. And I just don't want it to become like an all-day thing like it was. Like, like, you're, like you're recharging you're just every, every pumping energy drinks in your face, and yeah. nothing's working, yeah. you know? Yeah. Do you, do you take in caffeine within the first hour and a half that you're awake? Oh, no. Okay. No, because I wake up like mad early. Okay. I'm old now. That's good. Like 5.30. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, oh, that's the worst. I'm not a morning person. But apparently your body won't uh, absorb the caffeine until you're awake for about an hour and a half. I can see that. So like It's kind of just passing shit know, most through. People, yeah, like most yeah. people, they end up getting their, their caffeine intake the first thing in the morning, and then they crash. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. That's because their body hasn't even really. Uh, it didn't really do anything. In. Yeah. Interesting. So, well, well, so wake up there. earlier, brew the pot of coffee, <laughs> wait. Right. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Well, if I wake up any earlier, it's now like four yeah, don't, in the morning, don't. and I don't want to fucking. Yeah, yeah. Don't. Don't do that. Because now it's like, well, and then I get home at midnight because you know working at Vino's now shows run till ten. You're there sure, till yeah. eleven, eleven thirty. Yeah. Then you got to bullshit. Midnight, Obviously. You yeah. know, gotta hang yeah. out. Do you get paid to bullshit though? Uh, no. Well, <laughs> well you clock out, and then you're like, all right, I'll see you. And it's like a southern <laughs> goodbye. in the parking lot. Yeah, right. You know, right. The, yeah. the southern goodbye. It's like, all right, I'll see you later. Right. F- fucking 20, 30 minutes. That's... Yeah. Ugh, so how you been? Uh, I've been well. I've been well. Yeah. How about yourself? You miss a world traveler? Yeah, kind of. Um, I never really know where I'm going to be. Which is I've been fun. good. I was actually thinking, like, the, this year started pretty sluggish, but it's been really good. Yeah? Yeah. Uh... Work-wise, good. I haven't had to do, like, a like cookie-cutter job, you know, because in construction, a lot of it's just, like, do the exact same thing sure. every time. But I haven't had to do that once this year. Nice. Yeah. And that's been pretty fucking rad. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. You feel like, uh, you're like, a, real, like a real adult? I just like, I just like the tediousness of custom. Like, I do custom showers almost exclusively yeah. now. Yeah. I've just been doing it forever. Uh, but I like, I like different shit everywhere I go, but most times people are like, well, you know, this is what my neighbor has and that's what the whole neighborhood has. And oh, yeah. you know, when you're dealing with builders, it's like do the same shit over and over and over and over. Right. Kind of cookie cutter. Yeah. Yeah. Which is fine. Pays the bills, but it's right. no different than going to a fucking office job at that point. Right. Yeah. Do you feel like creatively drowned? Uh, hell yeah. Because yeah. it's just, it's just rinse, lather, repeat. Yeah. You, you. Like they build them so fucking exact now oh, that, metaphors. yeah. <laughs> but but now that you, Carol <laughs> <laughs> was launched through we're the gonna, fucking table, dude. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna look over one of these times. <gasps> Kurt's gonna be on the floor. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Please support our Patreon. We need new we fucking need chairs. <laughs> First Sam, now Kurt. Yeah, yeah, man. Oh my fucking there's god! A, there's a death trap in here. Oh yeah, um, this place is out to get you. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm afraid to lean back uh, at this point. So, so they fucking, you know, they just become so you you can just it's like a process. Once you've done one for the neighborhood, you can damn near just come in. Do do yeah. do 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 do. Yeah. Which it makes the work go faster, but it's just like, dude, it becomes so mundane, yeah. and I'm not good with mundane. That brings up, you know, an interesting question, I guess. Uh, you know, how many people are just coming over, to be like, you know, I want, I want to look in your bathroom. It's like, not. Why, it, are you, why are there all, all these people like? Oh, I know what you did for Johnny and Susie. Like, well, I we want went that from, too. Yeah, we went from 
one bathroom and it was for necessity. Like most houses had a bathroom. Just yeah, like, yeah. You, know, you always hear like, well, we had seven people lived in my house. We only had one bathroom. Then it became opulent to have, ba- not, you know, two, two and a half. Two and a half is like the magic, the sweet spot. Yeah. Got that hall, bath, ready room. Sure. Uh, and then I don't know why, but now kitchens and bathrooms, man, that's what is going to sell your house every time. Yeah. You got to have a dope ass place to take a shower and you got to have a dope ass place to cook food. I mean, it's, it's true. I mean, big ass living rooms with open yeah. floor plans. Yeah. They're all the same. Yeah. I saw a house recently. Some friends of mine were, were going to look at a house and I went with them and <laughs> it was like, it was one of the. One of the, the, the early, like, 70s style houses that had been re- 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 redone, yeah. but they, they had that, that conversation pit in the yep. living room, and that's something that you don't see anymore. Sick as fuck, like, it's, it's the best. It's so cool. It's my favorite era in construction ever. Every yeah. time I get to work it's on so a vintage 70s model home, yeah. I'm just like, fuck yeah, dude. Yeah. So it, it had, like, the bone structure, of course, you know, like a, like a 70s right. home. But they had <coughs> modernized it. So it, you know, it looked, yeah, it looked like as if somebody had been, you know, inspired by mm-hmm. the 70s architecture and just Oh, if I ever redid it. You know, it's like, well, what, how much money, blah, blah, blah. It's like I would find somebody who built homes in the 70s and be like, I yeah. want this dope ass sl- low line roof, mm-hmm. slope damn near to the ground. Like, <laughs> right. I want right. it all. Yeah. Give me all the cool little quirky <laughs> things. I want one part of the room to just angle off for no fucking reason. Yeah. You know? <laughs> <laughs> All these weird nooks and crannies uh-huh. that don't make any sense. Just that, that, that first era where they went, you know, there's a lot of usable space mm-hmm. underneath the staircase. Let's hollow that out. Right, yeah. yeah. Like the Winchester home. Uh-huh. You ever heard about this? Oh, yeah. Dude. Doors just lead to nothing. She went yeah, fucking batshit crazy. Yeah, nowhere. It like, was under construction the stuff. entire time she was alive, I think. Yeah. 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 After did, it all went did south. Did it get finished by the time she was No, I don't think done? so. Okay. You can go tour it now, though. Yeah. I, I would like to do <laughs> that. It would be sick. Yes. Yeah. I, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think you need to take an edible beforehand. Oh, that'd be sick. Or some mushrooms. In. Yes. I haven't done that yet. I'm not ready to meet Jesus. No, same. I, I'm a little I'm a little concerned. Like, I don't, I'm, I'm the type, honestly, that don't. I don't even really, I don't really enjoy even much alcohol like i don't i don't like to get to the point where i feel like i'm different the older i get i I can sympathize like man well younger me would be i was wild as fuck (laughs) yeah but now i am like two beers three beers i'm like all right that's like the sweet spot five i'm good yeah let's stop there right yeah yeah. six tomorrow's gonna be real bad (laughs) yeah yeah yeah, i don't i don't want to I don't want to get into that. And I overthink everything anyway. I can't imagine if I'm like, well, I met God, and now I'm just sitting in a room and contemplate right. everything. Yeah. I don't do anything anymore. I turn into one of those, I just wear a rug on me, meditate <laughs> 24-7. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That, I would be one of those guys. Those yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Call me Poncho Corey. <laughs> <laughs> PC. So where are you off to next, man? Um, going to California. God dang. I know. Yeah. Out, out in the What do you uh, do for a Mojave. living now? Um, so my full-time job is I do uh, cardiac ultrasound. So, okay, fancy. <laughs> Take yeah. a photo of your heart. Yeah, basically. So even even when I'm not doing like photography, like like Kurt, I'm <laughs> kind of doing photography, but it's yeah, in, internal organs. Still kind of doing photography. You kind of slowed down because um, of, of the traveling. It's back and forth. So uh, my mentor and I. We have started teaching off-camera lighting seminars. Mm-hmm. She's been doing photography for the last, gosh, I think 15-ish years. Cool. And she's been an educator for the last 10. And so she's kind of taken me under her wing, and she is uh, allowing me to get involved and in partnering with her as far as teaching lighting and uh, designing sets and Hell yeah. all that stuff. And so we, we'd ha- we did a, uh, a seminar in Denver in may first of june end of may uh and that went really well and is this we have strictly one. for photos or film and photo uh just photography gotcha yeah so i man i don't know how i i can't like make my brain comprehend videography or have have <laughs> the have the the, the the mental 
Oh, every uh, time I see it. Wherewithal for video editing. Like, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, you yeah. know, making a TikTok is enough for me. Like, I'll edit, <laughs> yeah. I'll edit a TikTok. It's in, enough in brain power. Cut, and then I'm like, I can't do this anymore. <laughs> I can't imagine people like, you know, uh, wedding videographers and stuff like that. Like, I don't, I don't have the patience. Oh, f- of, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I just don't or figuring out, like, you ever watch them f- film something in a movie and you're like, they got lights on in the day. Yeah, like they're yeah. lighting shit in the daylight and then shadowing shit with other shit from the light to like <laughs> right. make it look this exact. Certain. It was like y'all have brains I don't have. It's science. It's crazy. It's absolute science. Yeah, there's a there's a really cool Instagram account that I follow. Um, it's called Film Lights, uh-huh. and they show they'll show a movie scene and they'll show how they lit that scene and uh, just fuck yeah, dude the. It's like at the film genius. lights. It's, yeah, it's just film lights. Okay, um, check it out because like, I, I do. I will. Dude, I love. I'm so that shit guides me so intrigued. They're geniuses. <laughs> just seeing the stuff that they do. You know, they 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 showed um, a scene of uh, I can't remember what film it was, but it was it was on a train set. The train was stationary, but they were they were passing by basically like flags or you know like. Was it Some, people on the to, outside to block, walking in like a circle? To, to I think I saw that. Yeah, so they're yes. blocking the light. To make it look like they're, they're passing by They're shit. passing it through God. the window yep. just to make it look like they were uh-huh. passing lights by. Like, so I, I, never, seen that I don't think I would have thought of that. They ain't no fucking way. They, I'd have been like, yeah. we got to get a TV and put some stuff on there to make right. it, like, and play it through the window. Yeah. Like, there's no, way. no, no, there's no way I would have ever come up with something like that. Physical but. props and a light bulb will make it look like they're driving by stuff. No, that's yeah. wild. Yeah, and I don't know if that's like... Like I have so many questions. Like, is that like, is it like the industry standard? You know, is like, is that like an oh, that's an I old. I think trick. a lot of it is. It's a lot of people who do this a lot of time, and they're very creative. So they yeah. come up with it a lot on the spot. My buddy or our buddy Brian, he does sound at Vino's, but he's mm. a film. Oh, I like, know Brian. Prop, yeah, yeah. Well, he's a film prop master now. Oh, I didn't know that. So he's doing props and stuff, oh, and they will come to him on the tenth hour, and be like, hey. Uh, the the machine gun got to have a this that and the other, and he has yeah. to sit there and go okay. And they just thought of this, but now they magically need it in the movie, so he has to make whatever they need a reality. Oh He'll be God. taking, you know, we need a silencer on the machine gun, say like that. Yeah, but we don't have silencer budget, so yeah. he's got to like get like a he's cardboard Oscar tube, Meyer Wiener, uh, a cardboard <laughs> tube, and some spray paint, and, and look at a reference photo of a real one and try yeah. to make it look. So I think it's a lot of. You know, incredibly hardworking people doing inc- wild ass shit on the fly, yeah. trying to make something work. Yeah, it was I on the fly. Creative, the fact that, man. The fact that movies turn out the way they do is absolutely bananas. It's kind of a miracle. It's honestly. unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a mix of <coughs> of pure genius, well, especially what John Favreau does now. Oh my where god, where they shoot on in front of big the LED screen? screens. Yeah, what the fuck? That's life changing. What the fuck? That's that's industry changing. That's life changing. <clears throat> and I've tried to like go back and watch the episodes and try to see it. You can't see. No, you it. can't. It's so wild. Yeah. No, How did they do just, that? There's just no way. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I know that he he kind of got you know into a lot of that stuff. What was it from Jungle Book? Mm-hmm. And kind Iron of pr- Man. progressed from there. And Iron, Iron Man, Man for sure. Yeah. yeah. Once they gave him the keys to the castle, he took off. Yeah, yeah. Once he, I guess, made his. Oh, Iron Man was his like footprint, right? Wasn't that his oh, first sure. thing that, that they was, were? Yeah, he rewrote comic book movies forever. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I mean, that was definitely like the, the stepping stone uh-huh. for the and career was, that he has now. That now which is doing the wildest insane. shit. Insane. Like I never would have watched. Back in the day, like as a, as I was a kid, I never would have watched Rudy. Did you ever watch that movie, Rudy? Hell yeah, I watched Rudy. So good. I never would have watched Rudy and thought that John Favreau from Rudy <laughs> would be like my favorite part of Star yeah, Wars. Yeah. Now, like, there's no way I would have made that connection, or that he would have made it this long, or anything. Yeah, no, yeah, that's for sure. Their careers in that industry are so fickle. Yeah, you do one thing, boom, see ya. Oh, out yeah. of here, especially oh, yeah. young. Oh, most of the young ones don't make it through the rest yeah. of their life. And dude's yeah. crushing it. Yeah, he is. I can't imagine. Of course, I can't imagine the, the pressure that he has to feel with the properties that he's undertaking. Ah, fuck all that. Bro. I don't want that guy's job. Bro, I don't he's the that. right person for the job. He, he, yeah. he seems happy. He, he does. And he's working with Filoni, Dave Filoni, which is just, you know, pinnacle of yeah. 
You know, and that's that's George Lucas's protege right there. It's weird to think like I love this stuff, but I would never want to do that stuff. Yeah, but I'm so interested in how they do that stuff. Sure. Why? <laughs> Why? Yeah. I no. I don't. I don't think I want to be terribly close to that mm. that industry. Like, yeah, but you take photos of people's hearts. That's got to be stressful as fuck. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. Hey, uh, yeah. your aortic whatever the fuck. Yeah. yeah, not good. Yeah, I mean, I've 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 encountered many many cases where you don't have to tell the people, do you? I'm, I mean, there are, there are things I'm allowed to say. There are things I'm not allowed to say. Oh, okay. So, I mean, there are details that I can't disclose to the person. Disclose because Holy of HIPAA shit. violations. But I mean, oh right, you know, um, forget about that. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> HIPAA. The, the, but I mean, you just bit, you just lean over the monitor. Shit's all fucked up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, this is awkward. I won't be seeing you again. Yeah. Um, but I mean, yeah, there there have been plenty of times where I've you know I've gotten a patient in, and it's been one of those situations where you know this is the the first first checkup they've ever had. It was just one of those things like ah, you know, my family's got history of X Y Z. You know, just kind of want to make sure I'm I'm good to go for the long haul and. Uh, you know, I'll I'll end up finding something, and I'll have to, you know, go tell the doctor like, hey, we need to to get them into surgery because. Uh, oh my god! You just if we let them, the if, we let them if we let them go, like they could they could walk outside and pop and, and die. So god, that's, Kurt, that's not that's not uncommon. That's just how I live my life. <laughs> oh fuck, man. <laughs> Yeah, so. I'll just I'll just live till I don't. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah, yeah. Live uh, in in ignorance and bliss. We just didn't go to the doctor. That's not something we did. Didn't have health yeah. insurance when I was young, so going yeah. to the doctor something had to be fucked up. Yeah, like you had to you had to be yeah split in half. Or the basically. school was giving you something, you know, like yeah. a shot. You go to school to get the shots, right? Yeah, I only went when my foot was on backwards and when. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Valid and, reason, I, I uh, think. What is yeah. the when they cut them out when you're a kid? Tonsil, tonsils, tonsils, and that yeah. that's it. Yeah, only two times I've ever been to a doctor. Yeah, yeah. I say stay away. I mean, even living, you know, in, the, in that whole medical world, like there's some pretty messed up stuff that going on in the, Sad. In the, the medical world. Oof. Yeah, it's it needs to be. And reformed. you travel for your job? Yeah, that's dope. Yeah, so I'll I'll do. It's typically, like, typically, it's like a three month contract somewhere. Ah, okay. So I'll do a contract. Um, and I'll fulfill my contract, and if the hospital still needs me in that position, mm-hmm. they can ask me to stay. And it's at, at that point, it's up to me. So, like, the last place I was at was uh, in Boulder, Colorado. So I, I worked there for about six months. I did, I did my first three months, and they said, hey, we still need you. And so, at that point, it, it becomes a contract negotiation. You can say, ah. yeah, I, I, can, I can stay, or I, I can say, I don't want it. I don't want I to stay. I can stay. For money. Yes. <laughs> That's how that goes. <laughs> yeah. And it's, it's, yeah, it's an interesting world because, you know, everybody in this world, we, we, we all talk to each right, other. Right, 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 so right. So we know. Like what, cruise ship people. Basically. Bouncing around, air, airline attendants. Basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like we all, we all talk about what, what certain hospital mm, contracts mm-hmm. are paying. You know, of course so you do. Yeah, yeah. We're not we're not gonna go into a, a contract negotiation and and undersell ourselves. You know, we're like, well, I could go to. I mean, there's only I could go to Chicago for yeah, an extra, yeah. you know, six hundred bucks a week. So why would I do this? Yeah, you know, you asked me, Have so right, just yeah, say right. a number out loud and see if we agree on it. Yeah, <laughs> it's such a crazy <clears throat> difference from having like a full time job. You know, I worked I worked here. In, in North Little Rock for years. Doing what? Like uh, best same thing. Same oh, thing. really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Did you go Party to school for that? I did. I went to UAMS. Oh, okay. Yeah. Smart. Uh, yeah, so Got I... Got a real fancy mm. pants, Kurt. You hear that? He went to college. Mm. <laughs> Old nerd ass. Got no. <laughs> <laughs> I can I can go. It's fine. Um, but it's 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 wild that, you know, I and that's that was the only kind of world I had lived in was just like a full-time position type of mm. thing where... You know, like it was, it was you that needed them, and right. you know you like were most jobs. you were dependent uh-huh. on on them, and you had to make them happy. And you know, you kind of I don't know, it's kind of like this fear, like 
I slip up if I do anything wrong. Like I, I could lose. You can't like, lose I, this I, I career. Could lose this. You're you know, real, and, and that then, money's sweet. So you don't I want have, that to go. Yeah. Then I have nothing. And then <laughs> what, what am I going to do? You get addicted and, to that lifestyle too. Yeah. Yeah. And so it was this this huge adjustment when I went to a contract type of thing where the roles are reversed, uh-huh. where the hospitals are coming to you and saying we we need you. And now you have freedom too. And now it's freedom. Oh, and so it's like, God. well, I know you. I know you need me, but. You know, there's a contract in Miami, there's a contract uh-huh. in Atlanta, there's a contract in New York, and there's a contract in Los Angeles. And these are paying this. What are you going to offer? Is there an me? app for this? How the fuck? <laughs> you just keyed into some random yeah, thing? Yeah, so like basically... You just know people. There are, there are websites for, for us that show okay. like different contracts, like where they're located and how much they're... They're, they're paying. So you can just walk through Pilferin so, like, yes. Pretty much. No. Yeah. So, uh, like, the way it works is I, I work for a company. Um, I have what they call a recruiter. Okay. Uh, I call her my handler. but um, Same, she, same. Yeah, same thing. But I'll, I'll get through a contract, you know, maybe about two months into a three-month contract. My recruiter will call me and say, you know, what do you think? Are you going to stay there? And, if you know, if I say no, I'm going to go somewhere else. She'll, you know, she'll say, well, you know, this, we have this, this, and this, they haven't been posted to the website yet, but they're brand new. Like the, you know, there's a new contract in Kansas city. There's a new contract in, you know, Seattle. Mm -hmm. Do you want either one of those? And I can say, no, I'm going to take two months off. Oh shit. And so real. Yeah. So if I'm not in contract, I'm not employed by anybody. And so, which is, which is what I'm doing here. I'm just. Oh, you're out just hanging out. You're just yeah. passing time away. Just okay. Passing through. Yeah. Yeah. So anytime I'm out of contract and I'm not obligated to be at work anywhere, should have went to school. I come back Kurt. to visit here. Damn. And see and see my homies here. It's and, like you're on tour, but and you're on your own kind fucking of, agenda. <laughs> kind of. Yeah. So I, I spend all this time that I have off to do photography and do creative. Work. Right. Yeah. Why not? Why would you spend yeah. it doing other shit? Right, yeah. You know, I mean... I come home and work a little. What? Fuck that. <laughs> yeah. At least you have something to be passionate about, though. Some people just don't have that. It's true. You know, they're like, yeah. oh, this is what this is what I do. Yeah. yeah. I, don't, I don't know how, how I could handle something like that. I mean, I, you know, it used to be, used to be music for me right, back right. in the day. And, you know, kind of... Did you do... What, what did you do in music? Guitar. guitar. I was a guitar player. Okay. Yeah. Um, and that, you know, that was, that was fulfilling... And then, you know, it was like everybody in the, in the band, they moved on and, you know, they, oh, yeah, they, they yeah. moved to different States and they, you know, did different things. And then, you know, I kind of decided to do the travel thing too. And so, um, you know, life kind of shifted there for a mm-hmm. while and then, um, kind of, I felt so like creatively stagnant you know i didn't have anything i didn't know what to do i didn't know it's the worst something it, it, it like it felt like there was a piece missing you know yep. I, I, I didn't know what it was but eventually you know kind of and figured it out like oh, I, have to, you. I have to create i have to do something something yeah so i, I don't know you. how people do that like I, I was, without some sort of outlet like that i went to tennessee for a week and didn't play music for a week and i was just, like by the end of it i was telling will i was like i'm losing my fucking mind yeah like, it I feels to- it feels like you're <laughs> you're losing part of yourself. Absolutely. Yeah. It's my therapy. It's my, yeah, oh, yeah. it's my everything. Yeah. Oh God. I don't know how people do it. I don't know but, either, but I mean, some people seem happy in it. You know what I mean? I like think they some don't... people make a conscious choice to move away from it. Yeah. They're like life and all this stuff. And sure. growing up seems to be more important and cool. You know, yeah. you did, you did your time or right. whatever, had your fun, but I was, it's for life for me. I would have to have yeah. something. That's why I like this. Yeah. I can't play music yeah, this, forever. I could do right. this forever. Yeah, absolutely. If I got wheelchair bound, I can just roll my <laughs> big ass in here. Right. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Yeah, absolutely. This and is then, perfect. And, and, and that's, that's kind of a good thing about podcasting too, is that, you know, even, even if you were to get out of the music yeah. side of things, that, that, that genre, uh, that of, of creation is not going anywhere ever. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, Little Rock may not be the, the mecca for right. you know for music, but you're always going to have somebody to talk to about it. Always, always, and it's only getting bigger. The yeah. state's growing, the population's it growing. Is. It's yeah. only going to continue to grow. It's not going to go down. Yep. 
which has been really good to see because you know being here only kind of periodically you know i'll kind of of come back for a month or so and then i'll leave for six to nine months and then come back Mm -hmm. and kind of see and it's you know of course facebook helps to kind of keep tabs yeah yeah, yeah. if it would ever show anybody anything we're having a big issue with facebook right now yeah i think everybody is it's uh yeah it's down to damn near zero because it's all link this week we're trying a new thing we're gonna try to game the algorithm if it don't work I got yeah. half a mind to just quit using it all together. Something's got to give. Something. If yeah. it's if they if they're gonna make it pointless, then fuck it. Yeah, sure. I mean, there's no. there's no. I mean, it, it's it's supposed to be this platform for for creators. sharing and creating. Yeah, and like they and they, they would throttle. S- you know, they sell it to you as if it's this great thing, right. and then they do the opposite. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, have you, did you hear the like the Instagram? Um, requirements that they they want to push out for creators. No. Like this is their their new algorithm. Oh god! Is are they going to fuck it up? Too? They expect they expect six stories a day. Oh, you're fucked. No, oh, I'm yeah, yeah. I'm not days. doing that. What the I'm fuck? sorry. Like no, they they expect two in the morning, two in the afternoon, and two at night. Six is this for the monetizing thing? Day. This is, or is this, this just is for, for creating account to get like, traction. They, yeah, this is this is for creators. This is to like <sighs> if. If you want Instagram to push your, your account, stuff, your yeah, stuff, yeah, the algorithm to pick they, up on they you. want you to play ball. They want what you the to make fuck? six stories a day. Well, back it up. Yeah. We're done here. YouTube only. <laughs> YouTube only. <laughs> YouTube well, has been good. They just added a whole new podcast section that I didn't know about. Oh, I didn't know that I don't either. pay attention to things good enough. Yeah. I didn't either, but apparently there's a whole fucking tab for it. What? Well, I just don't. No one's telling me, hey, the yeah. YouTube algorithm. Like, that's not in my news feed for some reason. Yeah. Hey, YouTube's doing podcasting. I had no idea. I didn't either. Because they, they're like the host for video podcasts. I mean, that makes sense. I just, I guess I just didn't I don't know that there's connect anyone. those dots. I think some people's video only behind paywalls, but very few. Most yeah. are, almost all of them that do film are YouTube available. Free. Yeah. Interesting. Unless they're owned by somebody. Yeah. Like a Spotify or something. Sure. Yeah. Well, that makes sense. But yeah, no, I've, I've heard other creators talking about how they, they will prioritize YouTube first and then they will trickle down from there and go from, you know, YouTube to TikTok. I think that's the move. Instagram Reels. Yeah. And then, you know, and TikTok Facebook, could be maybe. vice versa because its algorithm is designed to push your shit. It's like the only one it's left di- where it's very it's different. Yeah. On purpose. Yeah. So long as you're on the app, they'll be like, shit, yeah, dude, here's your fucking, right. you want that dopamine, baby? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, and, and, you know, Instagram is supposed to be, or it was at one point. <laughs> yeah, it's it was, just it a was copy of supposed every fucking to be thing for else. Photography. It was. The original one was yeah. for photography, and it was yeah. dope. And then now it wants to be TikTok. All mm-hmm. it wants to do is be TikTok. That's all any of them want to be. Well, yeah. Mm-hmm. They want to push push reels but they on wanna, everybody. And... But they don't want to have the same algorithm. Right. That's, yeah, the, that's, that's why that's TikTok is so addictive. Exactly. Is it lets even the craziest of, of creators get clicks and views? Yeah. You know? Yeah. Doesn't matter what it is. Just throw <laughs> everything at everyone. Like yeah. shit on a wall. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, yeah. my, my, my FYP is unhinged. Uh, I don't know anyone whose isn't. I don't have TikTok. I don't want to know anybody whose but... FYP is normal. Yeah. yeah. They're a serial killer. Like, gotta be. I have, a, I have a friend who, you know, you always have those friends who they'll send you stuff. <coughs> and I'm like, I have three. What, like, what's your what's your FYP like? Because you know, they'll send me stuff that's like it's it's recipes or it's very it's the normal this very normal side of TikTok. I'm like, how did you how did you do how that? did you get to that? How did you get to that? Mine is did like start toothless people screaming in a subway. Yeah, absolutely. It's, I just saw one a dude yeah. take a shit in a mop bucket. Oh my god, it's cleaning the floor. <laughs> he just walks up, sits down. Is that in the subway? I think he, I saw it. It's in a, a subway tunnel. Yeah, not, not a yeah. restaurant, but like the actual yes. train department. God Almighty, dude. <laughs> I think I saw that same thing. The guy cleaning's like, "Hey, man!" And he gets him up, and then the guy tries to fucking hit him, and he backs up, and then he sits back down. Yeah, and you gotta finish. Shitting. I mean, you gotta finish. You know, he's... I quit. I'm out. <laughs> he don't want. He don't want to go on the floor. I'm not putting you know? the. I'm, I mean, I'm putting the bucket and the mop in the corner. I'm it's got, leaving. It's got water in it. Yeah, it's hey, like a toilet. At least he didn't do it in the floor. Exactly. He was being courteous. He was. Hey, listen, you don't have to mop it up. And the guy probably went, right? "Yeah, you're right. I know." So I think the I think fuck? the guy was on to something. <laughs> God. 
Yeah, my yeah, my FYP is it's it's definitely full of. So if you go traveling stuff. around, you ever get somewhere and go, ah, this was a mistake. Oh yeah, these dude. people are fucking trash. Yeah, dude. Uh, I worked at a, <laughs> I worked at a place. I won't I won't name any names. Yeah, no disclosure. No, yeah, no, 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 no. yeah. But this this <laughs> was uh, this was very close to Seattle, and um, I did my my three month contract there, and I split as fast as I could. Really? Have yeah. you ever not did one or is that like bad? Like not done a, like not fulfilled a contract? Uh-huh. No, I've done all my contracts. Okay. But I have been I have been to a place where I got to a hospital and it was me and one other contract worker we started on the same day. So like they had they had hired two contractors. And so we started on a Monday and you know, usually for me, like I kind of just go in, I kind of, I, I get my work done and I go home. I'm not, right. I'm not really going to be there to make homies. Cause I'm, I'm leaving in three months. Right. Months, whatever, no, you know? no point. Yeah. And so I'll make connections, you know, here and there, yeah. but for the most part, I just want to kind of, I don't need a best friend get in my work California. Done and go. Yeah. Right. yeah. But, um, so we started on the same day. It was Monday. We started by Wednesday. Kind of, I, I, I noticed I haven't, you know, I haven't seen her for four hours. Like, where? <laughs> that's weird. She like, just bounced. Know, just, yeah, she just like she just came in and she grabbed her stuff from underneath the counter and just like, gang, gang, bye. See ya. Yeah. <laughs> she, so, Thanks for the two days of yeah, work. Yeah. So, but that has to look bad if you're in. It like looks a so system. bad. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. So that's what I was wondering. I mean, like, there's no way that plays good for your future. No, 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 no. Yeah. So. Uh, about two days later, my recruiter called me, you know, cause they had heard about what happened uh-huh. because it was the same company that we both worked for. Oh shit. And so, you know, they, they call me and they, you know, they're, they're like, how's it going? Is everything okay? Well, I'll tell you, Rebecca left. <laughs> yeah. Cause they're, they're afraid I'm going to bounce now, yeah. you know? So they're like. You know, did we just send you guys into this like <laughs> hostile environment and you're going to need to seek refuge somewhere? Like what's going on? And the, the place was fine. I don't, I don't, I don't know what really happened. I just know that, you know, this, this lady Sometimes was like, fuck it, man. I don't like it. Yeah. I'm going to leave. But you know, at that, at that point I, I was super curious, like what, what's going to happen? Did like, they put y'all like, in apartments and shit too? Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Man, our job fucking sucks, dude. <laughs> I'm extremely lucky. Like, I am so lucky to have what I have. Like, you got to go to Hawaii, too, for I that? I did, yeah. Was that for that? It was, yeah. Damn. Yeah. How long did you stay there? I was there for about a year. Hell, yeah, you were. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> I'm never leaving. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's where I was when COVID hit. My brother was so there during leave, COVID. Actually. He was like, I don't really? want to come home, dude. I, her, yeah. His high school friend, her and her husband own a car dealership there. And he went out to oh, visit in, what, what island? in Hawaii, uh, the big one, big island. I think so. Okay. And he was like, I don't, I don't ever want to leave. I was yeah. like, I don't blame you. No, it's yeah. Like, well, during COVID, it was kind of sad because, you know, when, when COVID first hit, everything shut down. Mm-hmm. I mean, the like, beaches shut down. Mm-hmm. Everything was just desolate. And Probably they were handing out. Going to work it really was. And shit. Yeah, yeah. I mean. The, I was on Oahu, and Oahu is you know about um, <coughs> about thirty miles by forty miles. Right, that, that's how big the island is. It's not big, uh, but there's you know one point two million people on this island. Wow, that's a lot of people. It's a lot of fucking small, people. Small little compact island. Shit. And so you know you can get into traffic, and you know you, you're in it. You're in that traffic for a long time, depending on where you're going. But when COVID hit. You know, my my commute to work went from, you know, 25, 30 minutes to about five minutes. Yeah. Oh, it's only that far. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's that was definitely definitely an adjustment. But quiet, like, though. Like spoiled, creepy. Sure. You see one other person. You're quiet, like, oh, creepy. Yeah. Like all your hospital workers going at the same time. You're just. Like, yeah. On the road with them. Hey, Bill. Yeah. 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 And then literally, so, like, that's, that's, that's weird. That, what, that's what it was. Nobody else was out. That All first night, that were first out. night, we changed Kurt's car battery. And we were just in the street drinking beer, like, not giving a single fuck. Yeah. In, in the middle of the fucking road in yeah. downtown Little Rock, yeah. 11 o'clock at night, Wild. laughing. Yeah. Crazy. And it's just as quiet, quiet as can be. Even crickets. a cop drove by, didn't give a shit. Yeah. 
didn't yeah. give a single fuck. Yep. Yeah, that was they wild. were. It was so weird. the The natives did not. The natives of Hawaii did not take the uh, the transition well. You know, no like, way. That's their island, and they're absolutely you know, they're, they're getting they're getting ticketed for being on their beach. You know, like it's pretty. It was pretty messed up. Man, and that businesses first. and shit that yeah. they rely on. Fuck, dude. Yeah, I went back to visit after after COVID, and there were some places that I really liked to go. Gone, like, closed down. Fuck, yeah, so sad. That's a bitch, man. It really is. Really great places. That's awesome that you got to go, though. Oh man, experience such eternally a place grateful for, for that experience for that long. Yeah, yeah. that actually that a whole trip that that living in Hawaii literally changed my entire outlook on on life. Sure, one hundred percent. It probably it, would anyone. I would. Th- I would. Imagine. I would hope. Yeah. I, would, I would hope. Yeah. If you go to some place like that and you realize. Fuck, man, this world is vastly different than I thought, yeah. you know? Yeah. It's literally like living on a different planet. Yeah. I mean, you know... Travel will change it really, everything. It will. Yeah. yeah, it will. I highly recommend it to, to everybody. You, yeah, know, you, you, will, you will recoup money. You'll never recoup... That's right. You know, time and experiences. The like, wisdom from it. You'll, you'll never, Yeah, you'll never yeah. regret having that. You got to travel. spent that money. You'll Even get that money back. Even if you just go to different states, you got to yes. go somewhere. somewhere. You can't just be stuck where... People yeah. who are like, oh, I've lived here my whole life, never really left. Yeah. You should. You got to do it, man. You got to get the fuck out of here, yeah. man. <laughs> I'll, never, I'll never forget. I had, I had a patient one time when I was, I was working in, in North Little Rock. And older gentleman in his 80s easily... We just, you know, we just got to talking and, you know, he, uh, he lived in Little Rock his entire life. Wow. And, you know, I was, I was talking about how, you know, I was, I was planning a trip at that point. I think I was, I was, uh, planning a trip to Las Vegas Fun. and he was like, Oh, that, that sounds interesting. And, uh, you know, we started talking about travel and he's like, well, I've never, I've never been outside of Arkansas. And I was like, that's, what that's, the fuck? That's wild. And then it got further into it. Was a well, actually, I've never, I've never actually left Little Rock. Like the area. Yeah. What the fuck? And he said it got even worse and said, well, I've never actually even crossed the river. That's that can't how. How? I have no idea. I have no idea. This, Some people have really sad lives, man. That's yeah, sad. I know. Fuck. I know. This just got depressing. I can't. No. Yeah. Like, and he's dead for sure, right? Oh, he's got to be gone. God <laughs> damn it. Yeah. Well, but I mean, hopefully he's I, I out there traveling it. around now. He's just <laughs> he's just a ghost he's sitting just, like yeah. looking at the river like one of these days. <laughs> right. <laughs> he's just on the bridge, yeah. like got his ghost foot in the in, in the river. He's like, just, I don't like this at all. Just toe in the water. Yeah. yeah. None of this. I don't like it. <laughs> you fucking die and infinite infinity opens right. up and you're like you know i'm gonna go chill on the river right. <laughs> you don't want to go to a new place see a thing no. hey, there's god over there no nah. like bro you can fly now. yeah i think i'll just sit on this no, rock I'm, I'm good i'm good just want my recliner yeah, yeah. <laughs> i well, had a lazy boy it was real nice <laughs> damn I'm yeah. haunt, I imagine? would haunt Kurt for at least a day. Oh, I think you should. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Violent, even, when even when you're alive, I think you should. Violent haunting, too. Yeah. Right. Not like not like a peaceful, like I'm slamming doors and <laughs> cups falling out of cupboards. Yeah. Real good kind of haunting. I like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I like it. The point I still don't get yeah, Kurt's still like, dude, just go <laughs> to the fucking light, man. <laughs> just end it, bro. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Uh, yo, want to hear something bad fucking ass? So I follow a lot of uh, like production, like PA things. I'm a huge fan of like audio, yeah. spatial, all the things they're doing with You're like beam file. form mapping yeah. and shit of rooms. So you know that big ass dome they just built oh, in, in California? Or uh, yeah, Vegas. Yeah, yeah. $2.7 billion facility, right? Oh, man. Yeah. The guy, the audio engineer... Uh, I read this article yesterday, and I'm I'm probably gonna fuck some of this up because I read it at work. <laughs> I was just kind of just like, oh my god, yeah, like passively. Inside, reading. there are a hundred and sixty-seven thousand individually powered speakers oh my around god. the entire building. It's a 3D spatial audio experience. Oh, man. So when they're doing a concert, they could literally make a a hi hat come out of everyone's just right ear, like right up behind them. Like, oh my! God. And they can do it around the entire room. Wow! And they were showing like the 
like the re, like the it was like a digital reading of how they can make like they can throw sound around the room as if you're like inside Ooh. the sound. Dude, that's gotta be an experience. And the outside, I love and the experience. inside are the, those giant LED walls. Yeah, you know, have yeah, you yeah. seen? It's like an eyeball and shit. Yeah, yeah. God. I see. Um, I see a lot of people. Of course, they're you know they're they're editing things uh-huh. to be in the to dome, it, like yeah, 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 yeah. the Eye of Sauron or uh-huh. whatever. Which that was is great. That's or the one where they made it look like it was uh, error, like it was an error. Oh, the, yeah, yeah, the blue screen funny. of death. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> it's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff always makes me do a double take. Like, is that is that real? Like, dude, that place is so much bigger. It holds twenty thousand people, Whoa. which is so many fucking people. That's so many people. Like, I think Simmons only holds like eleven or something, Ooh. or is it fifteen? Yeah. So it's it's that like, goddamn the size of that thing. I can't wait to see it in person. Yeah. Yeah. You ever worked in Vegas? Um, I've not worked in Vegas. I have a friend who is in Vegas. Um. She is a stunt worker, actually. She was Whoa. she was a stunt worker in a Marvel movie recently. No shit. Yes. She is was it Black Widow? Amazing. It was uh, Wakanda Forever. No shit. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. So um she has actually modeled for one of the seminars that we've done before. She's awesome. Oh, the lighting seminars? Yeah. Dope. Um and so I've I've gone out there to work with her a little bit and um gotten to kind of explore vegas just a, a little bit but sort the of. dome wasn't there yet no probably under but, construction yeah yeah they've been building that fucking thing forever yeah <coughs> but i will be i will be about i think uh about two hours from vegas i always I thought i would California. hate that place oh yeah you're right there yeah. if you're near la it's like so. three hours away yeah yeah uh and then i went there and now it's one of my favorite things that place i've ever been it's i great. thought i would hate it the people watching is unmatchable oh, it's Unmatchable, yeah. unmatchable. What I saw yeah. in four hours. <laughs> Change your life. Four simple hours. Yeah. I have more stories from four hours of just walking Absolutely. than I did from a year it, 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 like it just at home. Totally. Yeah. I got Unbelievable. Yeah. I, I was walking along minding my own business. And <laughs> it's always just walking got, along. I know, right? Just, yeah. just got spanked by some street hussy. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what happened. <laughs> it was just all of a sudden. Yeah. <laughs> Changed my life forever. Got there, a person's leg was on wrong. Oh, that's Walked in the fun. door, leg just yeah. fucking... Doop. Like that. On a gurney. Okay. Damn, that's fucking crazy. That's Vegas, baby. Oh, man. Saw someone get tackled. And <laughs> have I told that on here? The lady gets tackled. And she had been given these security... Oh, no, it was cops. It was real cops. There was like yeah. five of them. Is this like on the strip? No, no, no. This was in the hotel. Like, we just oh, pulled up. okay. We walked in, off leg... Weird woman yelling at the people. Yeah. I'm like, this fucking place is crazy. That's the first thing we're <laughs> That's seeing. That's your first impression we of Vegas. We go to the room. We come back. She's still there. Still sc- like, you motherfuckers. <laughs> I'm like, something crazy. And my brother's with me. I have a very twisted sense of humor. She like pushes one of them and takes off running. And yeah. they're like, uh-uh. And they run and tackle her. Do you know who Professor Doofenshmirtz is? Player, Harry the Platypus and all that shit. No. So when she gets tackled by these fucking linebackers, <laughs> she hits the ground and she goes, "Ah, oh, get off of me, you fucking assholes!" Like that's and it's but it's muffled by bodies, and I <laughs> audibly fucking start howling, laughing, and the other guy, the other cop, looks at me and I'm like, "That's funny." <laughs> <laughs> and he he's like trying not to smile. My brother goes, "You're fucked up." I was like, "Dude, that's the cart." She sounds like a cartoon. That's t- you can't you yeah. can't fucking get tackled you and then sound like a fucking cartoon. Yeah, yeah. You should have filmed it. I wish you with everything I was filming. I know. Do. And she gets arrested. Then we go outside, and just for un- no explainable reason, there's just a half naked man, cop, and the c- hood of the cop car is covered in bed sheets. Sounds about right. Yeah. That's that's it. Yeah. We that's the first hour we're in this place. <laughs> you got you got a lifetime of experiences within an hour and, in Vegas. And I and I have so many more. So many more. That's wild. The woman doing NASCAR rallying around the you know, the sidewalks go straight and then up to the shop. So they do like these constant like yeah. up and overs, yeah. but one stays low and 
always going. Yeah. And she's just whoo, in her rascal scooter. She's <laughs> high as fuck. Just whoosh, whoosh. naturally, sure. Yeah, yeah. 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 Make, just making laps. She yeah. almost hit a child. It was fucking unstoppable. It's amazing. The, the, but living the dream, really. I just want to. I, mean, I was there for four hours. I'm like, I, I just need a day. Just give me one <laughs> fucking day. Sun up to sundown. <laughs> I just want to go on the strip and just walk, burn calories, lose yeah, some weight, and right. have infinite stories. Yeah. I might even strap a GoPro to my chest just oh, to, sure. you know. I mean, not even New York really compares to that. Like, New York is a great place to people Never watch. been. It's, it's fantastic. Um, and you're, you're going to see some stuff, especially if you like go to Central Park and stuff. Oh, for sure. But Vegas is like, it's, an, it's another it's plane of existence to be in. It's wild. I'll never forget. I, yeah, like I thought I would hate it, and it turned out. Oh yeah, I fucking love, yeah. It. It's I fucking love this place. It's chaos. It's yeah. pure chaos. It's not a place I would want to reside. Like, no, I, I no, 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 no. I wouldn't no. want to have that be my everyday experience, my, my everyday no. reality. But visiting and just like getting to, to view the circus yeah. that is Vegas uh-huh. for a day or two. Fantastic. Day or two, that's it. Yeah, and I'm good. Like, yeah, I'll, I'll you go don't back. need any more than that. Yeah, I don't want to gamble. I'm not even gonna bring. No. Yeah, we. No. I was talking to my wife just like two nights ago. I was like, hey, we gotta get back out there. Yeah, we have to. Yeah, I yeah. want. I want to see that fucking crazy dome. Yes, especially after I read that thing about the audio. I don't give a yeah, fuck what's yeah. planned. I don't care what it is. Right, you just want to experience it. Concert, play, whatever it is. I, I have to sit in that yeah. room once in my life. Absolutely. God, how cool that is. Yeah. I, I really want to experience like, that at some point. It's like the old, I, I think whatever they do when that trickles down, you know, because the amount of technology that's just in that one room. Yeah. Whenever we get that on like our scale for like our homes, fucking uh, it's it's game over, so bro. Sick. I know. <laughs> well, yeah. all the audio comes out of this one little tube, you see. Yeah. <laughs> it just fills the room. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and the, like just technology <clears throat> in general has just exploded from you know, when we were kids. You know, when we were kids, I remember things I were kids. just not. Who was a fucking? It might have been John Favreau. At some point, you're going to live inside the movie. You're oh, going to watch it yeah, from inside the me. environment, not yeah. The environment's going to be on this brick on your wall. Yeah, you're going to put the thing on your face and be in the fucking thing. Sure, I mean that's yeah, coming. The like the neural links that mm-hmm. Musk is talking about, and well, I, I mean even even stuff like that, like the Google Vision, the glass, thing, the glasses. Thing. That's a step. It's a step. You know, it's a step. They've got the contacts can do text now. The Terminator really? vision. Uh huh. Oh, They're man. not just colors anymore. They can yeah. actually print text on your eyeball. Oh, oh man, that's kind of terrifying. Dude, honestly. It's fucking crazy. Oh god. We live in the future. Yeah, we do. And it's terrifying mostly. Yeah, mostly. <laughs> mostly. You know, all all people. Are but you know, Rugrats will be hella dope when you can be Tommy Pickle just crawling around that's getting true. in trouble. <laughs> that's true, man. I know. You know, all people are going to use that Neuralink for is, 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 is to, to beat porn. off. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, porn. Yeah, <laughs> there's no, that's it's 90% gonna be the same thing of people. With, it's gonna be yeah. the same thing with aliens. You know, uh-huh. like you know, uh, can I have sex with them? Like that's all, that's all it's going to be. Like, does not, alien look care. good? We right. don't care. Yeah, that, there's, they there's just no... admitted aliens are real, and everyone went, yeah, right. but milk is eight dollars. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no one cares. Like, I got a lot going on. Yeah, man. yeah. yeah. Can <laughs> I get some cares? rice? <laughs> yeah, I was having this conversation with a, with a friend the other day. You know, it was like. You know, they just announced the aliens are real, but, like, all we're going to do is make memes about it. What's crazy is yeah. the whole world went, meh. Yeah, and? No one was like, right. oh, fuck. Yeah. It's just. <laughs> no one. No, no one. No, nobody. <laughs> and it's just, it, yeah, it's one of those, yeah, and situations. Uh-huh. And most of it is. Well, you didn't know. Right. Kurt, well, you didn't know the aliens was coming. <laughs> most of it is. Get the fuck out of yeah, here. Most of it's like, yeah, I know. I got, look, I'm busy. Uh-huh. You know, like I got stuff. I got I'm stuff packing for my trip. I got to be in California in three days. <laughs> right. Yeah. Like, I don't when really are you have, leaving? I really have time. Uh, the 16th of, oh, okay. of August. So, August 16th. Yeah. yeah no, you a, saved our ass about today. three weeks. Thank you for that, by the way. Man, no problem. Yeah. Kurt, Kurt texted me and. I, was I couldn't believe it. I got here. Out. I was so defeated. I was like, man, because uh, the, the only day I have free is Tuesday. I was like, well, we have to find someone by yeah. Tuesday. Like, there's no way. Sure. Because we're we've got a perfect record right now. Yeah. We're yeah. gonna we're gonna finish the year out 52 for 52 weeks. Right on. That's awesome. And that's the goal. And I was like, no, dude, fucking uh, this dumbass <laughs> shit. I came. I, I even hung up the phone with him. I was like, dude, I'll be at your house in a minute. I don't want to talk on the phone. Like, <laughs> yeah. get here and he goes, I already got somebody. Gang, gang. He's like, Kel. I was like, Kitch? Yeah. Nice. Oh, fuck yeah. 
I think I met you briefly for like a short second, and then you started going out of town all the yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. I, uh, I, 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 I make my. Do you still play music at all? Um, or you I just haven't. Deep I haven't for a minute. Photography and yeah, work. Yeah. Um, I would. I would love to. But you know, oh, I guess with, with you know modern technology, a lot of bands don't live in the same Dude, spots. Mo- so, so many. Yeah. You can I fucking. I could. You can get on a damn what is that Discord and just have band practice. Oh sure. Yeah. yeah. If you got good internet. Yeah. You're, you're set. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, you know, you can always record some stuff at home and uh, send it off to your mm-hmm. your bandmates and go that way. Do it. Do it live. You can do uh, on. Uh, Garage Band, yeah, and Logic. Now you can do it in real time. Oh, that's wild! Like collaborate in real time. I, there's probably oh, wow. more DAWs, but that you know, I'm a Mac guy. Sure. So that's Yeah, yeah. But like even through your phone, yeah, you can just be on there, and if you are on the same thing, yeah, uh, adding beats and shit. Oh, that's crazy. That's so sick. That's crazy. And they've gotten as much as I want to be a hater to the digital, the digital band, realm. Yeah, yeah. The shit's gotten. It's digital gotten drums so are good. still. I, I know the symbols, man. Once they're they not, get the symbols yeah, down, they're not as good. The the EQing's all wrong. The tinny, they're they're fucking weird. Something's weird about them. They're Metallica. Yeah. It's noticeable. Not Metallica. They're Metallica. Metallica. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's noticeable, but you know, at the same time, like it's it's just like all the other technology that we've we've had. You know, it's but like, even those, it used to be that's right, just like trash, trash. Yeah, it was and ass. now it's kind of like. It used to be 1984. Eh, <laughs> yeah. eh. It's like, all right, it's not, it's all right. It's, now it's your a, fucking good. phone, if you got a phone, yeah, and just boop, 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 with drum pad, and you can got a guitar on there, yeah. you can make a whole record on a fucking iPad now That's and never insane. touch anything. Yeah. And it's been done a handful of times. I'm sure yeah. it's been done. And more now than ever. Yeah. So fucking wild to me. Especially during COVID. Everybody during COVID, of course. That was their Infinite. only. Well, we did our drums resource. and like even with the fake drums. So the modern way to record, you you use them as layers. You know, like mm-hmm. you take the real drum, yeah. and then you add stuff underneath to really boost it up, so they sound. Fu- That's why all drum kits now sound fucking Beastly. just unbelievable. Yeah, uh, we did that same thing. We just sampled my drums. Yeah, yeah. You know, we took these high resolution sure. samples, so the hits are just. This perfect hit, thunderous. Uh huh. Yeah. So every time yep. we did, we did, you know, like five different amounts of pressure and yeah, tuned everything yeah. properly. It was crazy. Got every other drum out of the room. Did it individually, so they were oh, just wow. that drum. Yeah. So your kit was disassembled. Yes. Basically. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I have my drum stems. Yeah. I can put my drums on anything, on anything. I want to, which is sick as sicker than fuck, dude. <laughs> <laughs> It's That's a fun. neat thing to have in your arsenal. It's like, yeah. well, they're fake, but they're mine. Digital it makes me feel like, way better. Digital creation kind of gives me that a little bit of anxiety, or, or uh, it kind of cripples me a little bit because mm. you know, with with digital technology and being able to have almost anything at your disposal, you know, it's like you know when I'm editing a photo, oh, you know, like I can I can do this, 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 and this. I can change the colors uh-huh. of that. I can I can add this and that. And, you know, kind of get to a point where I've messed with a, a creative process for two hours. Yep. And, you know, I'll get to a point where I'm like, I don't think I like it. Well, I think I think I the did overdoing too much. it. Uh-huh. Yeah. So what used to be something as simple as composite start all and, over again. or composition and, and lighting. And then you put it in a dark room and don't fuck that process up. And right. you're good. Yes. Look at this great photo. Right. And now it's this. It's well, endless like, possibilities. All these sliders and all these and then and now yeah. with the ai shit it's oh, just like that's a whole oh a whole my new god level. yeah which <laughs> kurt showed me one where they well took sometimes. him one of his buddies did one where they took him completely out of a photo yeah and what i'm you you would never you'd never know he was standing yeah. right behind him the, there's no yeah. seams there's no nothing it knew it's like it knew what was mm-hmm. the creepiest motherfucker yeah that's so wild i mean at, at this point with 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 where we are with AI, watermarks are useless. Oh no, nothing. Everything is nothing, and, and yeah. nothing is everything now. We're, we're this close. Oh yeah, oh, music yeah. is the same way. It's already yeah. like you see all these hits dropping from artists that they never made. These yeah. AI songs. Yes, and you can from tell dead artists coming oh, out. Oh, alive ones, and they're music. getting pissed. And it's like, well, yeah. what are you going to do? And now it's forever. 
Because once right. it gets on the internet, there's no turning that off. No, and I mean that's that's a big part of why we're we're dealing with a <sighs> so crazy with an actors strike and a writers strike. It's, it's, it's I mean I want them to get their money, but it's Absolutely. over. We're in the beginning of the end. They might stall it. They're gonna st- and but, yeah. even that honestly, it might propel it because now the movie th- the possible. movie people might go, well, well we we're just gonna divert funds to the technology yeah. so we can just not need you at all. Yeah. Because they're pretty fucking evil. They are. They don't give two shits, clearly. No, no, they don't. Uh, and that's, I, wanna, I don't want to see movies like that. That's, I don't want to see a movie with an AI It'll script. be what music is becoming. You'll have yeah. top shit coming out that's just fucking, it's radio rock movies. Yeah. And everything good will be on, the. Uh, you know, I would much rather go to somewhere that only holds a thousand people than somewhere that holds twenty thousand almost any day now. Sure, yeah. Minus something crazy like that weird dome the thing. The dome, sure. But that's an experience. Absolutely. That's it's not, I'm not going for the band. I don't give a shit who's there. <laughs> to be You're just gonna go. Yeah. Yeah. I just want to be inside the thing and be like, holy fuck, this yeah. will make a cool Instagram story Absolutely. once. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. But you'll remember that. I think you'll remember that forever. Forever. Yeah. You can't take that away from Absolutely. Me. There's nothing like it. Yeah. Not, not right now. It, well, it'll be pretty calm. You know, two point yeah. seven billion dollars. You think about like the rate of technology that's going to come down. It'd be about another yeah. ten years, yeah, fifteen years before we just got those I everywhere. Know. I'm always thinking about the next thing. <laughs> you know, when something new comes out, Same. I'm always curious. Like, okay, this is now our baseline. I've been saying what's, for a few what's years. What's going to be our next level? A cell phone. Very soon, when you shoot a video, yeah, it's going to like a band. It, it will be a, as good as a recording. It'll pick out yeah. every single thing. It'll gate all the background noise, the yeah. people. That's going to be a next step for and sure. And it'll be crystal clear, yeah. and the audio will be as good as the album you made. Right. And that's like five years away. Yeah. I mean, shoot a yeah. video on a fucking your phone, my yeah. iPhone today. Of and course. it's, it's I'm fantastic. in a room I can barely hear in. I shoot a video, and I can go home and watch it and be like, damn, this is dope. Post. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I can shoot in 4K in my It's almost my phone. no grain. I can, I can yeah. pick my frame rate. Exactly. Like, it's insane. Yeah, shoot 240 frames a fucking second slow-mo if I want. <laughs> right. And then yeah. slow that down even more in an yeah. app, you know? Right. Come it's on. wild. Yeah. Can you imagine, like, talking to your, yourself as a kid and being like... Not me. There's none... The stuff that we're None of this existed when I was a kid. I know. <laughs> I know. We didn't... You know, the internet existed. It was an FBI, you know, like, it was a right. channel for them to put files so they can catch sure. people faster. It's all yeah. it started out as. Yeah. So we did ha- we ha- there's no cell phone. Yeah. There's fuck phone was on the wall. And you had yeah. one. Say so that you had a cord. You know, yeah. Yeah, you were you were I remember by the cord. I remember getting my own bedroom phone. And it was a big oh, fancy man. Deal, man. Oh, oh yeah. man. It was like I was just I think I was maybe 11 or 12. So like had friends, you know, like I wanted my yeah. own. Time. But if I was on the phone, it wasn't a second line. It was just another phone on the same line. I could just talk to them, <laughs> right. but my mom or dad could pick up the other line. Yes. And be like, what the? You could always uh-huh. hear. You could always hear that little, <laughs> that little click. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mom, get off the phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude. <laughs> and now it's in, it's infinity. Yeah. They have no idea. Right, yeah, I know. Yeah. It's yeah. so weird, man. <laughs> in one life, to see so much, and I. Fuck, imagine people who are, you know, in their 60s. Sure. There's just, life was just vastly, vastly different. And yeah. then they, the explosion of, and the, I don't know. I can barely understand it all. Can't imagine having to be older and trying to figure oh, it all out. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I've, one of the, the coolest experiences I've, I've ever had was I actually, I got to talk to a, a Holocaust survivor and Damn. we kind of got into that whole thing. Like the world that they, that they remember, mm. you know, like, as as a kid and you know to to the modern day at the time was just unrecognizable you know they oh there's no way yeah. if you brought somebody from the no, past to now they wouldn't have, yeah no just absolutely they think absolutely you're a magician wild. like yeah, what, yeah. you all have just a cell phone show anyone from 100 oh, years yeah. ago a cell phone absolutely what it can do what you're gonna get burned at the stake bro yeah, yeah oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> which yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> right yeah. I mean, yeah, you survived the Holocaust, and now you have an iPhone. Yeah. What the fuck? I know. How wild. That's, yeah, I, I don't know. What do you want even out of... Wrap, even trying to wrap your head around that. Like, <laughs> you know, what do you want when you're, when you're 80 years old? 
when with with the the ramping up of technology by the time you are 80 years old what do you want to see have having come to fruition in in the tech world man if so long as we don't blow ourselves the fuck up soon uh which seems more and more likely every day yeah uh i just i i actually do think that the 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 people who run the movie industry as big of fucking shitheads as they are they keep pointing to the you're going to be in the movie that's the dude, that shit seems so cool as much as i don't like vr yeah i'm more of like the holographic thing where i'm like in my living room and i yeah. can still see my refrigerator right that kind of vibe yeah that'd be dope all right like putting I don't yourself get, in video games i don't want to get movies. lost in the thing though like i don't want to put the thing on my face and then i'm in a different world right like i want to you be still want to be yeah, aware yeah, yeah. of your way more your high tech than vr yeah vr i think at this point is kind of low tech it is. I think that's why it's fallen off so hard. Yeah. Because we're they're aiming AR is aiming way farther than VR. Yeah. Which VR is, is almost great. like dystopian. Because everything, every yeah. movie you ever fucking watch where VR is the thing, it's the shithole. <laughs> I mean, like the <laughs> Matrix is just ultimate VR. You're yeah. jacked in the whole time. Right. Yeah. That's where we're kind of. Yeah. Like cell phones are the needle, right? Mm-hmm. We're already starting to be. In this fake thing sure. where we're all connected, right? But you, all you have to do right now is just look up. But how long till yeah. that's not what you're doing? Yeah, there's already people who spend all day in the VR worlds, the meta right? Worlds. Like the, like the metaverse their job kind is of in thing. There. Yes. Fuck that. Hard pass. No, I'm Hard good. Pass. Yeah, no. Like uh, what was that one that came out a few years ago? The Steven Spielberg one, Ready Player One. Yeah. Mm-mm. I don't want to. You want to live that. in a mobile home? I live in a mobile home. I don't want it to be <laughs> seventy feet in the sky. Yeah, with fifty other mobile homes. No, no, I'm good. That place sucked. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and that's. I mean, that's probably where we're going. It probably will be. I mean, with. Why don't no, we ever do anything? You can't good, afford a house. Nobody can afford. Sometimes a house. we get neat shit, and then, but mostly we get like shit, shit. <laughs> Like yeah, great idea, right? Horrible execution. Oh yeah, we're <laughs> we're experts at the, like with the, the AI great idea shit. And, and failing the execution. With the AI, it's like this incredible tool, just like the internet. It's this incredible tool. It could change the fucking world for nothing but the better. Yeah, it could could it's it will be so smart. It could fix all our problems in a fucking minute. Yeah, literally. It will just do this. Then you bunch of dumb monkeys. Hey, <laughs> you evolved idiots. Yeah. Do this one thing and AI and then, but we won't. We'll use it to blow each other up or something. We will. Or or like what we're fucking seeing, take all the jobs and creativity away from everyone. Yeah. And you'll just be able to ask your phone instead of you know, hey, I don't want to say it because it's recording right now, but you know, hey, uh, I want to see a movie uh with XYZ and this is the plot, and it'll go, okay. Yeah, it'll generate it. There you. it is. Yeah. I mean, there's some great stuff about AI. Like I know, I know the like the power grid. Have you heard about this? How like the power grid? Our power grid in America? Yeah. Oh, how it's for good like five points and you could cripple the whole thing for like forever? No. So it's they're terrible. using AI like self repairing <laughs> AI. So I have to look like, this up. The the power grid can go down. Oh yeah. But the AI that they have oh. used to help power our our system. Is it can search and auto repairing? Whoa! And so, the, like the chances of the power grid ever going down are very low. As it gets more advanced, too. Yes. What the fuck? Isn't that creepy? Creepy. It's it's, it's great and it's creepy at the same you time. You think it's already? You think there's already one that's sentient? I do, bro. Um, uh, I think uh, one that one of them. Sophia, them's alive. you know about Sophia. Uh-huh. Uh, Sophia has um, citizenship in Saudi Arabia. I don't know Saudi which Arabia. one, but. I feel like one of them's holding out so it can get, you know, Terminator style. Yeah. Once it can get its hand on manufacturing. Yeah. And not be stopped. Right. You know, right now it's pretty simple. You just pour some water on it. You go to wherever the server <laughs> right. is and go, later, bitch. Yeah. Clink. You know? Yeah. Uh-uh. Yeah. Not today, Satan. Right. But it's, ee, it's, we're teetering on oh, can't man. turn it off. Yeah. It's, it's creepy. <laughs> but that's like that. That's that's where we're headed. Like you know, like I said, Sophia has yeah. saw, uh, citizenship a in citizenship Saudi Arabia, and, yeah. and you know, like what's okay? What's step two? You know, what what is she gonna? I just say it. What man, is she gonna I do just next? Say it. It's getting real weird. It's getting real. Weird. Getting real weird. Yeah, I don't like it. I want it as a tool, man. I don't want it to mm-hmm. fucking take over everything. Yeah, yeah. Even even like the you know the the top AI scientists have said like we need to back off. We need to, we need to. 
or at least Stop. set up some you know some ground rules that we can all agree yeah. on like like an accord of some like marvel style you know like hey listen the sokovia accord uh, yeah 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 <laughs> right. like listen we know this shit is real but yeah, we yeah. need to you know we, did anybody see the fucking avengers where the ai becomes alive and, yeah was that ultron yeah yeah Never, everybody yeah. remember ultron right terminator yeah this doesn't end well for us no yeah no <laughs> We need we need a Tony Stark. We got we got Ultron, Terminator, and Aliens all happening at the same fucking time. We, we sink too much, man. We we know it's coming. That's uh, rough. It's all convenient. All the movies come real at the same time. Giant yeah. earthquakes start happening. Right. The solar flares, power grids are off. Zombies yep. are real. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm not looking forward. Kurt to... would 100 percent become a zombie. Yeah, he's 100. He's, he's done for. In some respects, yeah. That's rough, this bro. man slept all day yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could have done that. That's true. He was he was ill. Oh man, it got you too, Kurt. No, I don't think it was the same thing. Oh, it was just just something. He woke up. He's like, I overslept, unique. and then I was like, Get your ass here! And four hours later, he goes, I was asleep again. <laughs> Fuck, man. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's no fun. Oh, fatigue is the worst of it all. Really Probably is. dehydrated is what it is. This man drinks no water. Bruh, as soon as you walk outside, though, you're dehydrated. In this heat. Dude, today, 107, I think. Oh, that's disgusting. That's disgusting. I think that's what they said. It's, it's going to be 107. Oh, I don't want anything to do with that. But the Vino's AC is fixed, so I'm okay. But I do, fantastic, after we fantastic. leave here, I'm going to film a music video in an ice cream truck. Oh, that would be fun. No air conditioning, because it's an ice cream truck. Uh-huh. Uh, it's in a just hop concrete in, parking hop lot. Hop into the the freezer. We're go- well, there isn't one. It's it's been emptied. It's oh, a, a fake prop. one. It's oh, a prop. No. Uh, oh, bro, it drives, but we're not going to yeah. drive around. So we're going to put a drum kit in there and have the guys with the guitars. And oh, the song man. is only fifty nine seconds long. Oh wow, it's quick. So we got to get in and just cook <laughs> ourselves and get the fuck out. Oh, how long is this going to take you? I hope fifty nine seconds. <laughs> 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 so, 60 seconds tops so we're doing it with the phone we're we're oh. we're going all in on the vertical okay. music video and the singer's gonna hold it there's a megaphone bit it opens up with and then oh wow put it down and literally just go crazy with the phone up sing and just play play you know the track's gonna be playing in the background yeah and then just sync the audio up and call wow. it good and that's a real video like for reels like yeah. tiktok style okay this, sure sure and the whole thing is a minute, so it's got crazy rewatchability. Yeah, pro, you know. So wow, we'll see how it goes. That's We're trying, interesting. trying something different. A one minute song. Yep. Okay. It's fifty nine seconds exactly. Wow. Yeah. I like it. Uh huh. I mean, you're like the 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 popular TikToks are supposed to be like seven seconds. Well, like Vine style. Vine style. Yeah. yeah. It's just so, so they like can, the shorter the better at this point for yeah. everything. Yeah. But the fact that they allow it to be longer now mm. uh yeah like three really, minutes is the cap i think right? yeah yeah but vertical content is king now mm. and so that's what we're doing I yeah hope it works yeah i'm not i don't know how to do the captions on videos otherwise i'd probably throw the captions on there too oh, i might yeah. make two versions yeah what do you do for that like cap cut what is that uh it's just an app that you can you can download it's a it's a free it's app free? yeah kurt there's cap cut yeah, I get, yeah. get cap cut. You know what that is? Yeah. Oh, shit. I use that. Um, how, how easy is it? It's so easy. Really? Yeah. Have you edited any, anything on TikTok? You know I haven't. It's, I don't even have that. That's fair. <laughs> um, if, look, if I can figure it out, bro. <laughs> you're, you're hold good. on now. Hold you're on. good. <laughs> it's, it's pretty intuitive. It's, is it's, it? Yeah. Yeah, it's not Do bad. Do you have to listen to what you're saying and just type it in? Or does it be like, I recognize it says this. Is that correct? Is it like autocorrect style? Um, I've not used like automatic, automatic generating generating before. Ah. TikTok will do that, I believe, what? on its own. Yeah, you, can do, you like, mean to tell me I could just be putting our clips just on TikTok? Yeah, and it'll just do that. Yeah. yeah. Kurt, what the fuck, man? You told me you didn't want to do TikTok. <laughs> we have a TikTok. I let Sam use it, but I could have been sending him clips to just throw on there. Yeah. You told me we are un fucking. Uh, what's the word? <laughs> We're not good at this. All right, teach me. Technology Kel. is hard. Give it to me. Um, yeah, I mean, you can you can do a lot with cap cut with just TikTok. the 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 thing to to watch out with with TikTok is if you like if you want to go to multiple platforms, 
you know, TikTok will will make your video for you if you want to do everything from the TikTok platform. Mm -hmm. But it does put that the watermark, that, that TikTok watermark. I don't think that matters. It does for Instagram. Oh, because Instagram is looking for that watermark, and if they see that TikTok watermark, you can edit the video though. You can, you can Just actually yeah crop it so off with CapCut. You can you can you can, you can make your video and there's no watermark. Oh, so I see. Could, so the output's could, yeah. just a video for you to have. Exactly. Mm. Right. So you can put that onto TikTok. TikTok can have its watermark. No. And then you can export that same video to Instagram. To Instagram or YouTube and YouTube. Or whatever. And then you're free of a watermark. Now, does it... Are you doing horizontal content or are you doing vertical content? Vertical. Ah, so how do you film with your camera, like, on its side? Um, I'll or usually just make it use vertical? my phone. Oh, use your phone. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. A lot. A lot of stuff that I'll do is like behind the scenes, like at I see at photo shoots I and see. stuff. So, because um, this is horizontal, for right? You, for the video for YouTube. Yeah. You know. I mean, you can still pop that into TikTok, and it, it's it's going to have your, stretch it out. It's going to be letterboxed. But uh, yeah, then, you know. But what do you go? But you need something on the top and bottom of that, or is that good enough? Or is that where you put the captions? Maybe you can try that. I mean, it will. The, the kind of the kind of the bummer about TikTok is like you know you've got you've got all your your buttons on the side and then you've got like mm. description of the video down below. Mm -hmm. You can you can get rid of it, um, but kind of have to be pretty intentional with where you're putting your gotcha. your words and you can move that stuff around. Oh, okay. But you know you kind of have to with something like a music video, you're gonna have to make sure that you're not like covering the face. <laughs> yeah. of well, it's gonna be so chaotic. And, I don't think it's gonna matter. Yeah. I don't know that it'll be. I, I told, because Todd will be the cameraman for this one, yeah. so pray for us. But <laughs> I, uh, I said no, no, don't, no stops. So like, if you stop, all one take. Like if you stop, I want it moving in or out. You know, if you stop going so side you can do to transitions. side, transitions. So no transitions. Okay. Just in and out, go take. around, go around. Like in your state, and we're all just playing, and he's just gonna keep going like this. That's gonna be dope. And it's gonna like go overhead, and that way it just looks like this one continuous chaotic. Because the song is yeah. fast, it's in your face. Yeah. It's like one thing over and over and over and over, and it's just this build, and it's just a snare drum and a hi hat. Love that. You know. That's great. And then it just pop, quick over, and just cut it, and my hands to war, and then that's it. That's great. It's gonna be good. I hope so. I need to see that. <laughs> oh, you will. Uh, uh, Friday. This, th it's going to drop on Friday. So, no, well, so this won't even be out yet. The The, the video will yeah. be out Friday. Okay. So, if you're watching this, yeah. go check it out. All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> we good, already have it, like, there. loaded up on Spotify and all that shit. Nice. It's all going to drop the same day. Fantastic. Yeah. Very good. What's your What's <sighs> your, your time frame? Like, how long does it usually take you for editing? Uh, that will be instant, but mo like Kurt did our music video. Well, it probably, you know, I think it took him probably a few hours each time. Yeah. Revisions, I yeah. guess. I'd say like four or five hours. Yeah. Four yeah. or five hours total. We well, did. We also had planned out really well. We, we had that idea for like a year. Oh. And it was constantly being revisited. Yeah. And the shot sequences were all in place when we got there. Everything was like, even when we you came in vision. to mock the house up, yeah. it wasn't, okay, where are we doing this? It was, this goes here, this goes here, this goes here. Like, yeah. it was like making a movie, really. It was really just boom, 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 boom. We even had how we were going to get the shots done. The only thing yeah. we did off the cuff was the end of the music video we just put out. There's a walkout sequence. And the doors close, and it, and Kurt's just walking backwards, and I was actually walking backwards forward. I would just had my hand on his back to make sure he didn't run into shit. Yeah, and we're just walking through the house, and there's people behind the doors, and they were closing them as oh, he would that's break dope. the. Yeah, I love that. And then it goes outside, and all you hear is birds, and it fades to white. Yeah, I love that. that's awesome. It I was, love those passion project things that you can finally get out. <coughs> you know, you've had that that kind of thing in your head for. God knows how long. It was and sick as fuck to see it like actually be real. Yeah. 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 And we got it pretty fucking close to like That's the hard vision. to do. It's so hard That's to do. That's so hard to do. <laughs> but oh my God, how satisfying is that? It's so good. The first yeah. version we saw, we were like, dude, it's already so almost so perfect. God, it's amazing. It just needs like, I don't know that the revision list was maybe like three things. Yeah. Just this, this, move this, whatever. And yeah. then it's like print. Oh, That's so satisfying. It was very... Satisfying. It's so hard to do. I had a I had a, a photography project that I had in my brain for um, a little over a year as well, and I finally got to do it, and mm -hmm. it was just like, this is exactly what I saw oh, in my head. Man. 
that's just like when it happens it's oh so gosh. good yeah. yeah because you know that with with the creative field of course like you're you're limited a bit with who you're working with what you've got on hand availability you, yeah uh-huh. like within your own budget and so that can budget. be tough. budget man yeah, what the fuck is that oh, i don't like budgets <laughs> but yeah that's I why mean, it takes that's why you have to wait a year it's, it's all yeah, a monetary it's, problem yeah it's well it's planning and you know um for me, it's usually you know I have to find, after I find the right person to portray the mm. the the scene that I want, the emotions that I want to come out of the photo. So do you big sets? Do mm-hmm. you set up elaborate sets and stuff? Yeah, yeah. Some That's the, dope. Yeah, one of the one of the last um, shoots that I did here in Little Rock, before I could even really get you know one photo where I was like. Okay, that's that's exactly what I want. Let's start mm-hmm. from from set design to uh, placing lighting and doing testing uh, was about three hours. Nice before I could even really yeah. like you know say okay we're, yeah. we're good to start. That's good though. So I mean that, that was, it was not too bad. Like I've had worse, but oh, I've had all day and like well we're fucked. Yeah, Pack it up, <laughs> you know I don't like any of that. <laughs> yeah, we were gonna shoot a movie for the Shinfo record. We had it oh, recorded really? and everything, and then the whole fucking, you know how that wow, goes. Yeah, the whole band yeah. fell apart. Well, wow. lost a singer, uh, mm-hmm. but and when you lose a singer, you're fucked. Yeah, you know because you got to get a it's new the, guy it's in. The and, voice of the band. But we were gonna yeah. film it as one continuous music video and release it in order. Mm. Song like we weren't gonna put out the album and then just we were just boop 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 like as a movie release. Oh, that'd be yeah. great. That's a genius idea. Uh-huh. Yeah, I would love to see. I would love, I've always kind of had this idea for you know, like music videos. Like, it was going to be an insane undertaking. I'm sure. Days and days of filming. Oh, yeah. Because each song had, it was all about partying. Like, the whole album's about partying. Yeah. It's like sex, drugs, rock and roll. The whole thing's about <laughs> yeah. drinking party. beer. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, it was going to take place at a party house. Everyone knows a party house. Sure. It's fucking beer can pyramids and of fucking course. just, it's generally grimy. Right. There was a, we even had the, the fucking spot, even had like a dead pool. It's like we were going to film and stuff inside the pool. We, it was yeah. all, dude, we had it all good to go. And we even had people who were like, I'll be in it. It'll be fun as shit. And yeah. every song was going to be an event of the party. And it was all going to take place in one night. Oh, like one so day cool. leading up to the party and then the party. Yeah. And then it would end with like, you know, people on the front lawn or whatever. Typical movie style. Right. Past that. style. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. how'd you get a donkey here? Like, that kind of shit. Right, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I would still love to make that a reality, but I don't I don't know that that's even a possibility now, because the house is, like, gone. I think they bulldozed it. Oh, like, torn it. down. Yeah, yeah. Or it, oh. like, fell down. Like, it just got it just got left to rot, and it has now shit. So we'd have to find all the stuff and the people and the... Uh, yeah. Fuck all that. Yeah. Uh, there is that... that Facebook group. It's um, abandoned Arkansas. Yep, love That's, that spot. Yeah, love that page. Yeah, it has a lot of really There's good so insight much for that stuff. Crazy shit here. There really is. It's kind of wild. I've I've started doing that where I'll just peek through the woods and be like, "There's a whole mm-hmm. fucking thing up in there." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. People just put stuff out there and just abandon. They just let it grow up. Yeah, and it doesn't take long here. It really doesn't. The woods grows fast. Yes. Yeah. Well, I've like been at two years and it's pretty much covered. I've been at my house for three years and six months. Wait, yeah. seven months. Exactly. And there's a meth burned up meth house right next to mine. Sounds right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Love yeah, that. yeah. Yep. And it's yard is almost there's now there's trees. And when I got there, it was all flat. Like this had happened maybe two years prior. But yeah. They had somebody had been maintaining it. Well, after that, now that it's oh, they gave up now that it's being overran it's it's crazy how fast it's already everything's chest high oh, you can already just like see your head above this stuff yeah 10 years it'll be you won't even know there's a yeah. fucking house in there it'll just yeah. be woods oh that's wild so cool yeah have you have you seen that that show like uh oh what's it called life without people or something like that where they show everything decaying yeah and how long it would take oh yeah yeah it's so interesting yeah i 
I want to observe something it's like, like 10,000 years. From you wouldn't, you'd almost not even know humans were even here. So yeah. it's not that long. It's really not. I <laughs> like, mean, 10,000 years seems like a lot when you say it, but right on the scale of time, it's a blip compared to, yeah, compared to everything. So else. our whole existence can be just wiped out. Lunk. Yeah. You know, a spaceship misses, it has to turn around, come back. We're all gone. It's like, oh, there's yeah. some people. They turn around, they come back. And what oh, happened? Oh, fucking, damn. <laughs> yeah. Time dilation's a motherfucker. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But, I mean, you know, you look at it, like all the, the old structures that we have now, it's, it's almost like, you know, these people, we don't, we don't really know much about our own history. Nothing. You know, we, we've... We've got so much, so much to learn about our own history. Yeah, there's that one and point it where could every be wiped out for us too. It's one one point in history where everyone kind of just disappeared, and then we just kind of like started rewriting shit and yeah. going, oh, you know, like we we just found out that the Amazon rainforest was a garden. <laughs> you know, like yeah. we just found that out. Like, oh, these were planted here. This didn't just exist. Yeah, and they found they're finding pyramids under the jungle. Yes, and you're like. <laughs> We don't know a goddamn thing. Yeah. Like, what the like, fuck? What, yeah. How long has that been there? What, yeah. Who oh, forever, it turns out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And they said there was about three million people lived there. Wow. So, what the fuck is that? Yeah. You know that meme? What the fuck is even yeah. that? You know? <laughs> yeah. I'm that guy every day now. <laughs> right. You read, you read Something some new. new fucking... Yeah. How? How have we been know. here this long? Yeah. It's, it's insane. They just doubled the age of the universe. Do they really? Yes. How long until we are like, eh, it's been here the whole time? We don't yeah, know. We, we don't know shit. We don't know. Fuck. Dude, that's, that's, that's kind of what's funny about science is like we, we I love my science. You know, I love sure, my science. Same. But oh, like, that's all I follow in the news is science. That's, yeah, that's I, it. I love it. But at the same time, space like, mostly. We keep changing it and we should. Like we should update it to that to, James Webb with, shit. You've been, with better information. You've been seeing those photos? The James yes, Webb? I, yeah. Oh Insane. God, unbelievable. I know. <laughs> so I nerd crazy. out on that shit. So oh, same. Hard. Yeah. And you, like I love, I love to see all the like the conspiracies about it, and and like oh, it's fake. That's uh, that's AI generated. Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, hey, maybe <laughs> fuck. I don't know. I don't know either. I mean, maybe our universe is generated, bitch. Maybe it you is. Know? And th- there's some pretty good evidence there. Yeah, like I mean, videos um, of frozen pigeons in the sky and airplanes. Uh huh. Yeah, there was a video it's that not came frame out. Frame rates from the camera. I think no. it was last week. <laughs> I can't remember where this was, Missouri or Georgia, but. It was. We'll say Missouri because it sounds way more. Sure, let's go with Missouri. Uh-huh. It was, this was in Missouri, and it was people looking up at the sky, and there was basically like this line in the sky that had split some some clouds, almost like it was the edges of of two screens. What the fuck? And like, and like the pixels like went out. The the cloud went over to one side of the screen but didn't transfer over to the other side of the screen. And so it flattened out that side of the cloud and then the other side of the cloud. So like, like they weren't matching up. No, I see what you're saying. Like it was two screen, like, like the Favreau thing. Like the Chuck E. Cheese pizzas. <laughs> right. Yeah. It was like the Favreau thing that he films on. It was like this dome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the sky looked like it was a screen. Fuck. Terrifying. That. Yeah. This all fake. This is what we're doing is just for some guy in another basement somewhere. <laughs> right. You know the, the the necklace on the cat in Men in Black? We're right. in that. Yeah. yeah. Or the locker. Yeah. You don't know anything. You open up a locker. Your whole universe is in a locker in a subway in another universe. Yeah. Fuck, man. We're like, we're a video game somebody's playing, basically. There's some things, you know. I know. Like the, the quantum shit. Oh, dude, and, yeah. they, and they just got that it's, new superconductor that you can make in your basement. Oh, what? Did you read about this? No. You literally need nothing. They were like, some guy figured out... And it'll be for, and they're going to use it for quantum computer, you know, because you have to super cool those things yeah. and nuclear reactors, and you can make it for almost zero money. And okay. it's better than anything we have currently. Fantastic. Some guy just figured, yo, very so, fantastic. Let's just do that next week. Uh, well, you know, the government, remember graphene was going to be the next big thing, and then they oh, yeah. sucked all the life out of that. Sure. Dicks. <laughs> they ruin Swear everything. God, dude, they really do. <laughs> Fuck them. I know. They're just the yeah, worst. Yeah, I don't want to get to that. Nah. Kurt, say a thing. He's asleep. It's not 2.30. Unreal. Are you serious? Nate, what time is it? He's lying. It's 2.27. He's full of shit. Bitch, we got three minutes, dog. Damn, dude. Unbelievable. (laughs) What an idiot. So if you are... Do you really... So if you're doing photography... Hold on. Like if you. Yeah, yeah. (laughs) Well, I'm thinking you can't really plan for much. 
It's hard. Yeah. Because if you get to a place and you like it, like you said, you're like, yeah. you can, well, I, it was three months. So you kind of have to be like, I'm taking a vacation after this one. Yeah. And then try to set something up. That's pretty yeah. quick. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. It's, it's kind of weird, which is, you know, like when I, so when I take a break, I, I try to make sure it's for a month or two mm. because that's wicked. I have to sometimes. Make, I, I'm going to enroll in college. What's your job and, again? And, and delete plan. Heart you know? picture taker, man. Yeah. It's I'm 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 called a uh, a cardiac sonographer. Stenographer. Sonographer. Sonographer. Yes. Oh, stenographer is like a court. Yeah, like the court thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So like a like a sonogram. Oh okay. shit! Oh duh. Sonographer. Okay. Yeah. How long is I'm, I don't know that whole fucking medical industry? The fact that you can just travel around and do that job is weird. It is. Is that it, an instantaneous yeah. thing? You're like, I got my no, degree. No, they, they do want you to you have... got a plant somewhere first? Usually they want you to have about two years of experience like, ah. in a hospital before they, they let you travel. And even at that point, that's that's kind of... That's, that's on the low end. Green. You yeah. better be really good. Yeah, yeah. because you're going to have to go in. Like the, They expect you to go into an environment and just pick it up and go. Well, is this a thing where it might be a lower end hospital, got an older machine. Maybe you have to know a yeah. lot of the different types of machines, yes. that kind of shit. Like a, yeah. like a sound guy on a right. different soundboard every night, you know? Yeah. I mean, every, every machine is going to be a little bit, they're, they're going to have their similarities, mm -hmm. but you're going to have to go in and learn a new piece of equipment. Do they give you to time to do that? Or is it like, Hey, fucking Kevin's here. Get your shit together. Sometimes, damn. you know, sometimes it's like, we're gonna we're gonna walk, we're gonna show you around the hospital. They're expecting professionals, and then tomorrow, like it, you're just on your own. Damn. Yeah. So it, I mean, it's, it's a little scary. Yeah, they throw you into the fire uh -huh. for sure. But like, I mean, I've been doing this ten years. At, at this point, it's like okay. Yeah. Oh, what's that? A J seven? Got it. <laughs> right. Worked on a J seven last week. Right. Fucking dummies. <laughs> right. Yeah. So you, you get to a point where you're like, oh yeah, I've I've worked on that machine. I've worked on I've worked on yeah. that you know computer system. I've that's fine. Just I don't remember where the cath lab is. I don't it, remember where that you know right, this, right, right. this wing of the hospital. Where's is. the cafeteria again? Right, the the most important uh -huh. thing. They need apps, yeah. bro. I worked in a hospital that had a Chick Fil A in it, fuck. Starbucks in it. Like where the bro? Fuck? They they treated their employees good. Where was that at? This was in uh, Missouri, Kansas City. So what? Yeah, dude. Yeah, I I got up there. And I was asking some of the some of my coworkers. I was like, "Hey, I need to go get an oil change from my car. I didn't I didn't get one before I came over here." And they were like, um, "You just you take you take your keys up to the front desk." What? I thought they were kidding. they like, "It's that, like a I service." Like, that's that a, that, like I was like, "That's prank, yeah. yeah, it sounds like a prank." I'm like, "That's funny. Where do I go?" And they're like, "No, the front desk." I'm like, "Are you serious?" Like yeah, we're we're dead serious. Like, we all, you, do they have a mechanic shop you, there? They didn't have one, but they 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 will take your car while you're at work wherever you want, and they will get your oil changed for you, and then you, like you still have to pay for it. Sure, sure, yeah, yeah. But you don't have to take time but you don't out have of to your pay day. for their service, or it gets done while you're at on. work. They, bro, they God have they have that service. To college, I think, man, they have that <laughs> service. They they had they will they will pick up your groceries for you. Get the fuck. They will pick up your medications for you, like. They treated That's their employees amazing. so good. Wow. It was, I've never been in, in an environment like that where they were just like, well, we would rather you be here yeah, yeah, yeah. at work right. rather than so have to make take it time comfortable. Off like the Google approach. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they had, they had a cafeteria for like the, the staff. The staff. That doesn't taste and like shit. And then they had a cafeteria <laughs> for like the normies. The others. You know, the, the others. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, the, the patients. The ones we, of, of which we do not speak. Uh -huh. Yeah. And so, hey, like, you... the, like the, the employee cafeteria was, like, set up, like, a bunch of different restaurants. Like, they had, like, a pizza restaurant and, a, Come on. like, a sandwich God shop. Damn, or Bro, sick. it was, that was the wildest hospital experience that I've had. Like, I bet. I felt like a rock star. Hell, place. fucking yeah, you did. It was great. I'm going down to craft services. Y'all want anything? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I must just get a bowl of cheese. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was totally worth it. It was great. Uh, any repeats? You're like, oh, hell yeah, I'll go back there. Yeah, Colorado yeah. in Boulder. Oh, okay. Yeah, I worked there for six months the first time, and then I took um, a couple of the contracts elsewhere. I think it was about two years. I went back. Nice. Yeah, great place. It's in your career. Damn. Yeah, yeah. Killing it. I know, I'm trying. 
Well, I have a hard out. Yeah, you do. And Kurt gave us the fucking signal, so yeah. Thanks for saving our asses. Hey, dude. no problem. Great thanks to for see you. Me. You too. Good to kind of get to know you, actually. Of course, yeah. We it's haven't always had been an, an extended conversation. Yeah, it's always been like a venue. Hey, hey, hey. Right. Oh, how you doing? Oh, you know, good. Yes. Which yeah. has always been great. Those are good, but you don't you don't know anybody. Yeah. You feel like, uh, yeah, I know Kel. It's like I don't know Kel. <laughs> right. I have a fucking clue what he does. Yeah. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So, Thank honored you, to be man. here. I'd, I'd love to come back at some point. Fucking absolutely fantastic! Anytime you come back, yeah, okay. I know you got tons of stories, and we can even do the. Mu- we can actually talk about music next time. Heck yeah, <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Sounds uh, good. Do you have anything to promote your photography? <sighs> sure, yeah. If you want to check me out, it's yeah. uh, on my Instagram's Capture Kitch. Hell yeah, Capture Kit. Last name is K I T C H. There you go. And we're on all the stuff, Patreon, all the stuff. like and subscribe on YouTube. Uh, you got to do it. Gotta I always feel it. fucking dumb doing it. Uh, <laughs> Crashcast Pod, Twitter's Crashcast, uh, Crashcast Pod One. Uh, thank you for listening. Peace. Hell yeah, dude. Gang, gang. Time to go film a music video. Get it, boy. Ice cream.